Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another video. Very recently, I performed a Pushpanjali dance item in this channel, and today I'm going to share the tutorial of the same. So, Pushpanjali is one of the first dance of a Bharatanatyam performance. It is a tribute to the Lord of Dance, Nataraja, Guru, and the audience. So, first, let me tell you what is Pushpanjali. Let's divide it into two words. One is Pushpa and Anjali. Pushpa means flower, and Anjali means folding hands to show respect. The Pushpanjali that I performed is Angikam Bhuvanam Yasa. Yes, After this video, I'm going to share with you the whole slokam and also the meaning of the same. In the description, I'm going to write down the whole slokam along with the meaning. The choreography that I performed in my dance video might differ a little bit from the particular uh, tutorial that I'm going to share with you. In this tutorial, I'm going to share with you all the basic steps that you can perform and you can always modify it to the choreography that I performed in my dance video. So let's start with the tutorial. So at the beginning of the dance, you have to hold your hands up like this. Stand straight in Samapadam, which means both feet together. Now just bring your right leg up and place it towards your right. And this leg will be pointed upward. So let's do the hand movement. From Anjali, we are going to change our hands to Ala Padma and bring it downward. Just straight from up towards down. So let's do the hand and the leg movement together. Let's stand like this. Angikam. From here, we are going to bring our leg again together. So we were here. Just bring your right leg beside your left leg and stand in Samapadam. Left hand will be Dola Hasta. Another one will be pointed upside. And we have to roll our finger like this. So this is the mudra and we have to just roll it like this. While you do the step, just look upward like this. So let's do both the steps together. Angikam Bhuvanam And from here, just stand as it is and bring both the hands like this and bend slightly. So let me show the hand movement. So this is the mudra. Both hands will be same. Bring it here and slightly bow down. Bhuvanam Yes from here the next step is we have to put our right leg forward just fold it and place it so place your heels first and then your toes and you have to just move all your body balance towards the front so let's do it again bhuvanam yasya next we have to put our leg front all the body weight at the front and from this mudra, this is Mukula, just open Ala Padma. And your hand movement will be from, from your mouth, go away. So let's do both the steps together. Bhuvanam Yasya, then stand straight and move forward, open Ala Padma straight. From here, just change your hand to Pataka Hasta and move it and bring your left leg sideways and hold it like this. So let me just break all the steps. So first we are doing this Ala Padma straight from here this is Pataka Hasta. All the mudras have been shared in my channel before so you can go and check all the mudra videos first. So from here you just move your hand both sideways from here Hold your hands like this and just bring it towards your ear. So it's very simple. I, I guess you all will get it. So let's do it one more time. So from here, Vachikam Sarva Vangmayam. Let's do the leg movement. So from here, we were doing this step and now just bring the left leg sideways. So just place your left leg. The heel will be just in the position of the toe of your right leg like this and sit in Aramandi. Bring both the hands together towards your ear and close your eyes. So this is the whole step. Let's do the first part together. Angikam Bhuvanam Yasya Vachikam Sarva Vangmayam 
we completed this stay from here leg there is no change in the leg movement just do the hand movement and the body movement let me show you the mudra first this kataka mukha mudra we are just showing the jewelry the earring like this and like this and third step is from here we are showing the necklace so let's do both like all the three steps together so we completed here from here aharyam there is no change in the leg movement from here now we are going to move our leg just place your left leg left side and just face left side diagonally so let's do it we were here now place your left leg and all the body balance will be shifted towards the left and face diagonally towards left hand movement will be just ala padma upside diagonally and mukula hasta from here just do sam dam so 3 4 5 like this this is actually the sam dam so hand gesture from here just join your legs in samapadam just look up and just bow down hands will be in your chest same mudra that we used previously look up and bow down stand straight with dola hasta left hand and here just move your hand like this it will be a very subtle movement don't exaggerate this one and two from here now we are going to do the nataraja pose from samapadam sit in aramandi and put your leg up let's do it again the let's do the hand movement first it is pataka hasta so where you place your kataka mukha while just starting your dance just place your pataka hasta there and bring your dola hasta just below that hand it will be a loose hand do not just tighten this hand it will not look good just loosen this hand and this is the nataraja pose now let's do the leg movement sit in aramandi place your right leg slightly away sit yes. more then just put your left leg up like this so always remember this particular leg will be parallel to the hand posture the left hand okay so let's do this together from here sit in aramandi place your leg bring your hand and your leg together and keep it parallel so do not just turn like this you have to face front like this sit more the posture will be better now let's do the whole shlokam together with the mini from here angikam bhuvanam this means whose whole body is universe vachikam whose words sarva vangmayam all are literature like whose words are all literature aharyam chandra taradi means whose jewelries are sun and the moon tam namah means we bow down to you satvikam shivam it means pure lord shiva bhuvanam yasya vachikam